What's up guys, Adam here and welcome back to another AC Milan career mode in FIFA 17. Today's gonna be a shorter episode because I need to get this episode out and I need to go to work soon. So if you don't see it, it's because I wasn't able to post it. But let's start off with a squad report and I'm gonna be telling you some of the players I'm gonna be letting go in January and some potential players that I would like to pick up because we have been linked with them in real life. So We've got Gianluigi Donnarumma, 88 overall. Gabriel, 77 overall. Antonio Casade, 57 overall, has gone up by two. Davide Calabria, 77 overall, has gone up by three. If I'm blocking some of the stats, I'm sorry. Uh, Jonas Venson, 77 overall, has gone up by one. Antonio Rinaldi, 65 overall, has gone up by two. Daniele Rugani, 82 overall, has gone up by one. Alessio Romagnoli, 81 overall. He's actually increasing in some stats like strength and sprint speed. Gustavo Gomez, 79 overall has gone up by one Ricardo Ricci 58 overall has gone up by three Nicolas Santoro 59 overall Gabriel Paletta 78 overall has not decreased by anything he's still there and his contract expires in seven months Rodrigo Eli 73 overall has gone up by one Gerson Vergara 71 overall Mattia De Chilio, 79 overall has gone up by one Luca Antonelli 76 overall has gone down by one he could potentially be leaving in January. Mario Piginocchi, 62 overall. Suzo, 81 overall, has gone up by one. I don't know why he's unhappy. He's been playing a lot of matches. Jose Mauri, 78 overall, has gone up by two. Matteo Kovacic, 82 overall, has gone up by one. Manuel Locatelli, 73 overall, has gone up by one. Yurai Kuchka, 78 overall. He is homesick, so I think he does want to leave. Marco Greco, one of the first youth players I signed, 57 overall, has gone up by three. I'm still waiting a loan offer for him. Andre Modic, 66 overall. Giacomo Bonaventura, 82 overall. Memphis Depay, 82 overall. Valerio Gasperoni, 63 overall, has gone up by two. Gianfilippo Felicioli, 65 overall. Giovanni Crociata, 64 overall. Mattia Guidi, 56 overall, has gone up by two. Hakim Mastura, 72 overall, has gone up by one. Ricardo Saponara, 83 overall, has gone up by one. He's actually injured. He'll be back in about 13 days. Anwar El Gazi, 78 overall, has gone up by one. Ricardo Fontana, 60 overall, has gone up by three. Eduardo Rossi, 64 overall, has gone up by two. Carlos Baca, 82 overall, has gone down by one. But the only stats he's going down in is his sprint speed and his strength. Other than that, he's pretty decent but I think I might try a swap deal for him in January and by Niang 82 overall has gone up by one I think he should start playing as the striker we do have Cedric Bakambu 83 overall who I really really do like as a player that's why I brought him in but he hasn't been getting enough game time and he is unhappy so I'm gonna try to slot him more into the lineup maybe try to push Baka out of the way maybe play Baka for some I guess lower table size just until January see what I'm gonna do about that Andrea Lombardi, 54 overall, has gone up by one. Gianluca Lapadula, 76 overall, has gone up by one. He's unhappy, which is a shame because I really do like him and I really want to play him. Andrea Belotti, 79 overall, has gone up by two. But it doesn't feel like he has been doing a lot. But I want to keep pushing him into the lineup because I do want him to be one of our starting strikers in the future. And we do have Marco Colombo, 70 overall, has gone up by three. Last time out, I offered Davide Calabria a new contract and he has accepted it very very happy about that let's jump into the first match of this episode we might only have three matches this episode once again and we're coming up against Atalanta who are in seventh place they are doing very very well this season because we had the Champions League game a few days ago we're gonna have to rotate the lineup Donnarumma, Sventon, Rugani, Paletta, De Chilio, Locatelli, Mauri as you can see he is very very tired Kuchka, El Gazi, Belotti and Memphis Depay is our starting 11. Atalanta uh they have Carmona, they have D'Alessandro, they have Bertolacci, and they have Alberto Paloschi, a former Milan player. Uh, don't know why they're doing pretty well on the table. I guess they just have really good chemistry and they have been playing good. But I'm looking for a victory here, boys, because uh, last time out, I was only able to pick up one and I really wasn't happy about that. This is some nice passing. Here's Andrea Belotti. He's got the pie on the wing. That is a nice ball into the pie. The pie was some good dribbling into Belotti. Belotti laid it off for Locatelli. Locatelli takes the first time shot. It makes a complete mess of that one. He's going to look for something, but he doesn't have much. He's controlling it himself. Out to Svensson. Here's Jonas Svensson. Can we whip this one in? Elgazi's there. Defender for Atalanta is forced to make the clearance. Now we've got ourselves a corner. Here's Mauri. Mauri, whip this one in. Can we find somebody's head? Nobody's there. 
Nobody is there. It's going to be picked up by Deshilio. Deshilio to Yurai Kuchka. Kuchka into the middle to Belotti. Belotti lay it off. Does. Why did he? Why did he pass? Why did Rugani pass? It's okay. Svensson is not going to pick that one up. Nice Rugani. No, Rugani. Come on. You have to keep the ball. You have to keep the ball in it. Here's Gomez. Here's Gomez. That one's into the middle. Donnarumma. Great save. Let's clear this one away. No, 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 no. Takes a deflection. And Donnarumma with the reflexes to save that one. Ah, what a save by Donnarumma. Right on halftime. And they've got themselves another corner. Bertolacci to take. That one's whipped in. Kuchka, nicely done. Can the pie get to that one? No. They're just going to head it wide to Bertolacci once again. He's probably going to try to cross it in. That's a cross in. Donnarumma is there. That's going to be the end of the first half, boys. I don't even think we have a shot on target. Let's get into the second half. We need a goal. Bogazzi. Mauri. Locatelli. Locatelli. Kuchka. Come on, boys. Where are you? Where are you? Locatelli. Nicely done. Back into Kuska. This is good passing. Kuska to Belotti. Belotti, let's take the shot. Good block. Belotti was in space. Good block by the Atalanta defender. And now let's try to whip this one in. El Gazzi into the middle. There's the pie. The pie. Go for the header. The pie. Maybe could have taken a touch. Locatelli. Locatelli over the top. El Gazzi. Yes. No. Maybe a foul. What a ball by Locatelli. Come on. On what a ball by Locatelli. And he got taken down. Nice Locatelli. Come on. We've got time. We've got time. The pie. Two. No, no, referee. You just signaled three minutes and then you blow the whistle. Oh my goodness. I do not even think we had a shot on target. We did. We had two. But nothing's going in. I think I need a new striker. I have some ideas for the January transfer window, but come on. I want Belotti and maybe Niang or Bakambu to be the starting strikers. Maybe I should have brought on Bakambu, but nothing went in against this very, very good Atalanta side. And we walk out of here with a draw. At least it's not a loss. First training in this episode, Emmanuel Locatelli has increased to a 74 overall with an A on perfect delivery and a B on El Rondo. Hopefully that makes a difference. We're still in second place. Now Lazio does have a game in hand on us. Hopefully they do not win and push us out to third place. Let's go take a look at the table. We're now in fourth. Well, we're all tied with 31 points. And we actually achieved an objective. Just wanted to thank you for helping the club reach one of its brand exposure goals. We wanted to earn 20 million through media earnings within three seasons. And we completed it in one. We need a victory here, boys. Torino, let's do this. I don't think they have Joe Hart anymore because his loan did expire. I do want to see where Torino is in the table. They're in 16th. That is a sign. We took Belotti from them. Let's see if he can score against his former club. Main lineup, Donnarumma, Calabria, Rugani, Romagnoli, De Cilio, Mauri, Kovacic, Bonaventura, Suzo, Belotti, and Niang. The good thing to take away from all of this is that we've only conceded four goals in the Serie A. Only. That means our defending is right and our goalkeeping is right. You saw Donnarumma has made some incredible saves. Let's see what we can do here, boys. And I'm actually thinking of maybe trying Niang as a striker at one point. Uh, the, the only thing is, he's not the best at finishing. And that's the only thing that is putting me off about playing him as a striker. I should have made a pass before to Belotti. And I wasted that one. They do have Mortolivo. And they also do have our former manager, Sinisa Mihajovic. Uh, yeah, hope nothing for, for hope nothing but the best for him. Let's see if we can walk out of here with a victory. Montolivo on the ball already. And passes that one to Aramu. Aramu on the wing. De Chilio. Come on. De Chilio just falls over. The cross into the middle. And we've conceded. Eight minutes in. We concede our fifth goal of the season. Heads that one past Donnarumma. And we're down 1-0. Martinez again. Nice block by Romagnoli. Romagnoli to Niang. Niang into Belotti. Belotti, Mauri. Mauri, I've got Suzo. Let's see if he can get that ball over. Yes. Suzo, get a good touch. Here is Suzo taking this one in. To Be Belotti. Nicely done, Belotti. Belotti. Out wide to Niang. Niang. Let's return the favor. Suzo's in the box. Punches it away. Mauri with the volley. Mauri. Completely screws that one up. He just had to keep his composure. And maybe could have finished that one on the volley. Wasted opportunity once again. Suzo could not find the header. Suzo. Suzo, Belotti. 
Velotti back into Ma uh, Suzo. Suzo to Jose Mauri. Mauri into the middle. That's a nice ball to Velotti. Velotti, Zappa Costa. What a block by Zappa Costa. Come on. How do you want to score with defenders like this? Here's Kovacic. Kovacic whipped this one in. Niang is in the middle. Niang gets to the header. Good save, goalkeeper. When are we going to score off a set piece? Here is Suzo. You know what? Suzo whipped this one in. Back post. Romagnoli is there. Romagnoli. Heads that one wide. We just cannot seem to find the mark. We cannot seem to find the back of the net. I know it's headers, but Jesus, they're blocking everything. The headers don't want to go in. It's just not a good time right now for Milan. We're not conceding a lot, but when we do, it's going to freaking hurt us. Bonaventura to Mauri. Come on, boys. Come on. Mauri in. We can't even get a pass. We can't even get a pass off. Nice interception, Kovacic. Here is Mateo Kovacic. He's got Belotti. Let's give this to Belotti. What a ball, Belotti. Ball roll into the middle. Belotti, let's take the shot. Niang is there. Niang, finish that one. Niang. Niang, all you had to do. That, that's not the first time he does that. That is not the first time he does that. Makes a mess of that one. Come on, we could have drawn the game level. Let's go, boys. Let's go, boys. Let's put that one behind us. Come on. Let's go. Out to Suzo. That is a great ball. Here's Suzo with this one in. Belotti's there. Belotti tries to get to the header. There is Calabria. Calabria takes the shot. We have seven shots. We have seven shots. And none have gone in. Niang tried to get to that one. But Zaba Costa heads that one back. And that's the end of the first half. How many shots do we have on target? How much possession do we have? I do want to see those stats because this is not normal. Seven shots. Four on target, 51% possession. They have zero shots, zero on target. They have one goal. How does that make any sense? No, I just took myself out of the players. Daniele Baselli, Daniele Baselli, good block. Come on, boys, let's get this out. Let's get the... Come on! I don't want to rage, but come on! The ball is bouncing everywhere. What is this? What the actual hell is this? Slots that one past Donnarumma. And just like that, it's 2-0. With their first shot on target. With their first shot on target, it's 2-0. Don't make any sense of that one. Taking off Belotti, bringing on Bakambu. I'm taking off Kovacic. He'll be bringing on Kuchka. And I'm taking off Niang because he just doesn't seem to want to play. And I'm bringing on Memphis Depay. Suzo. Calabria. Calabria on the wing. Back into Suzo. Nice ball, Suzo. Suzo. Doesn't have anything. Lays it off to Mauri. Mauri to Depay. Depay into the middle. Let's go for the shot. De I have no words. I have no words as to what's happening in this game. I have zero words. I have nothing that expresses what I'm feeling right now. Like, I have nothing. Like, just no words come to mind right now. Nothing. The passes are all off. The players can't finish. And we lose 2-0. A draw and a loss. And that doesn't look good for us. That does not look good for us. Especially with all the teams pushing forward. They had one shot on target. We had four. Nothing wanted to go in. I cannot believe this loss. Davide Calabria has now increased to a 78 with a D on 1 on 2 defending. Final match of this episode coming up against Lazio. Good thing we're still in second place. Lazio in fourth. If we can pick up a victory here, I think we will be sitting good in second place. Let's do this at the San Siro. We need a victory. Might be Bacca's final match with Milan. And I do have some very, very big players that I want to try picking up in the January transfer window. Let's do this. Lineup: up Donnarumma, Calabria, Rugani, Romagnoli, De Chilio, Loca. Tzeli, Kovacic, Bonaventura, Suzo, Baca, and Niang. Come on, boys. Come on. We cannot go an episode without at least one victory. I'm confident in you guys. We have a good record at home. And just nothing seems to be working today. I don't know what's going on. Here's Baca into Bonaventura. This is some nice passing right back to Baca. Baca on the... Mm, tries to cut inside. Good block by the defenders. Immobile. Good. Calabria. No, no. What? That... What? What? A red card for Rugani for what? When did that happen? When did that happen? When did that happen? He's going right. He's going right. He's... When did that happen? When did that happen? I don't understand what just happened. Rugani just slid by himself for no reason. 
He got a red card and it wasn't even me who was controlling it. It was not even me who was controlling. <laughs> I, I don't know what's going on today. I don't know what's going on today. Taking off Kovacic and I'm bringing on Gustavo Gomez and we're playing with two midfielders. Let's go. Do we have one more attack? No. Nope. End of the first half. Bullshit penalty for Lazio. And we're down 1-0. Let's go, Davide. Davide Awaita to Suzo. Come on. Cut inside, Suzo. Let's go. Push this in. Here's Suzo. Suzo. Let's whip this one in. Baka's there. Baka with the finish. Nice. Nice goal by Baka. Good positioning. That one's into the back of the net. Very, very, very nice. Thank goodness we scored a goal. Thank goodness we scored a goal. Baca scores it. Sixth goal in the Serie A. 63rd minute. I think that's our first goal all freaking episode. Nyang. Nyang. Yes. Out to Bonaventura. Bonaventura. Yes. Bonaventura has it. Bonaventura. Let's go for the shot. It hits off the post. It hits off the post. Come on. Come on, boys. They left, off. They left us a lot of space on that one. They left us so much space on that one don't know why they're pushing so far forward i think they want the victory come on boys we have to take advantage of this gonna be taking off locatelli bring on saponara he's back from injury and i'm also going to be bringing on uh you know what i'm gonna be keeping on baka he scored the goal i have faith in him let's just bring on uh the pie for suzo and play niang as a right winger why are you taking it in the corner why are you taking it in the corner here's keita come on boys Come on, boys. Why are you taking it in the corner? Why are you taking it in the corner? That one's crossed in. Donnarumma picks it up. We drop. We can't score a goal because they take it in the corner. They've been taking it in the corner for like the past five minutes. We walk out of here with a draw. Let me go show you my shortlist for the January transfer window. We are in January. Let's go take a look at some of the emails. Bakambu wants to leave. I'm going to grant him that request. Like I said, I liked him, but... He hasn't been getting that much game time. I'm probably going to be selling Bakambu, Baka, and maybe, maybe Lapadula to try and afford to get one of the biggest strikers in the game, Antoine Griezmann. He's 90 overall, 26 years of age, 83 million, just absolutely incredible. And I also, also do want to get, where is he, Ricardo Rodriguez, because he's actually linked in real life. And now he's with Juve in the game. Don't know why. So we're going to try to sell some players. We're going to try to get some money. Let's go take a look at how much money we actually do have for this transfer window. If we go take a look right now, we have 45 million. Actually, no. If we adjust the wages, we have something like maybe 60 million, 58 million. And if we sell some players, then we're going to have a lot more money. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode. Uh, let's do one final training. I'm sorry. We, were only, we weren't even able to pick up a victory. I'm sorry. I don't know what happened to the game. The game was pissing me off today. And the final training, every single player gets a D. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you next time. Do it! Do what? Just do it! Okay, do what? Do it! Subscribe to my channel. But I already am subscribed. Oh. So subscribe to my second channel. And also, follow me on Twitter at TheNobsYT. No, what are you waiting for? Do it! Just do it! But I can't. Yes, you can! Oh, okay.